battle power is rising so fast. Yeah, I'm like that. I'm like that. Ten toes down. Always been on that. <laughs> oh, 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 she's gonna throw me out of my armor. That's cool. That's fine. <laughs> oh, I'm already getting chills just thinking about it. Are y'all ready? I'm ready. Are y'all ready? I'm ready. <laughs> it's been so long since I've seen this one, bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get lit, let me get lit, let me get lit. Good times, good times. What's good, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Lotus Asakor, the one who never knows. Why is Kid Boo's torso so long? That's half Super Boo. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Lotus Asakor, the one who never knows best, bringing you Dragon Ball Z Budokai 2. If you keep it up with the series, then you know that we just finished a complete and entire playthrough of Budokai 1 here on the channel. And I'm continuing on with my playthrough of every Budokai and Tenkaichi game because we're also hyped and excited for the announcement and release of Tenkaichi 4, which we still don't have a release date or actual official name for, but this is a series I have been planning on bringing to the channel anyway. So that's what we're doing. We finished Budokai 1, now we move on to Budokai 2, which I think is overhated. As a kid, I thought it was cool, and I think I'm still gonna like it when we play here through it. We play through it here right now. Let's go ahead and get this new save file created. Ah, uh, it's exciting, it's exciting. And then you get like the what diffusion. Oh, and I remember on the loading screen, you could spin the sticks around and spin Roshi faster and faster and, ah, man. Long ago, seven Dragon Balls were forged, which when gathered together would summon the eternal dragon to grant a single wish. The quest for these magic orbs is a perilous one, one that Goku has faced all too often. For over time, the allure of the Dragon Balls has attracted a host of powerful villains. Ordered to protect the earth and to prevent the Dragon Balls from falling into evil hands, Goku has thrown himself into battle. And always, he is fueled by a single burning desire to be the best. Like no one ever, wait, wrong series. This is so unique and creative to me back then as a kid. I don't know, I always thought it was really cool. We'll see if my feelings stay the same. I will say though, I do wish it still had cutscenes like Budokai 1. Exterminate the people on this planet with the Cybermen. Actually, you know what I would just remember? So like stuff is starting to come back to me. It's been a long time since I played through Budokai 2. The things are coming back to me. You can collect items and like the you get the dragon radar and it'll show you where to dig for dragon balls on the map. Another thing that's really cool about so like this, I don't know what you'd compare it to. I guess it's kind of like Fire Emblem to a degree ish, like very, very loosely, vaguely. This game, Shaman King Power of Spirit, they kind of take some influence from Fire Emblem, which I had known about as a kid. I probably would have loved those games because I love them now. Um, but what's cool about Budokai 2 outside of just th that aspect and everything is that you actually get to create an experience that can be kind of unique and different from other people. Like if you had a friend or even like a sibling who played through the game separately, like the, the path you chose, the fight that you, you interacted with, it's still gonna basically be most of the same, but you, there are some decisions and some fights that you get to get to have that my, everybody might not have in their playthrough. And you get to also pick different allies. It's really weird because I can pick Goten and Trunks right now when I should not be able to play as Goten or Trunks, but I'm gonna do it because I can. So I'm gonna pick Kid Trunks, cause why not? And we're gonna go ahead and get the Dragon Radar real quick. I don't remember how to use the Dragon Radar. Okay, so there actually is a Dragon Ball on the map. Cool, 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 cool. And you can dig for items and stuff. Let's go ahead and grab the sword, which I give, I believe gives us an attack boost. Yeah, 10% attack boost. You can also get things that give you like more health, more defense, stuff like that. Um, and obviously like some of these battles are optional. Like obviously every board has like a, a battle that you have to do, but all of them are not mandatory. 
Oh, we're gonna go ahead and fight this Cyberman. Can't you talk for real? Ah oh, man, it's been so long since I've seen all this stuff. Started with uh, King Kai Fist times 20 off rip and same inputs as Budokai 1, so you know. But yeah, man, I'm excited. I'm hyped. Oh man, what a what a jump in graphics. Like, I think Budokai 1 still looks good in some ways. This is definitely, definitely different. Also, I might need to adjust my volume after this because this game feels a little bit louder than the last one. Also, movement. Movement is a lot easier in this one, it feels like. I say as I get kicked in my chest by Cyberman. Okay, that whiff. I said this. I said this game was gonna be easier, and it's not looking. It's not looking easier. I'm gonna have no health to fight the rest of this map. <laughs> Yo, the Cyberman is on guard all right now. I'm not about to. Okay, I was about to say we're not about to lose our very first fight to a Cyberman offer. Oh, there's gonna be multiple Cybermen. Right. All right. That's that's obviously why that icon is there. We're gonna lose. We're gonna lose our very first fight in Budokai 2 to Cyberman. Unless, <laughs> unless, unless. Oh, close call. Close call. <laughs> Anywho, also from what I remember, I believe the uh, the squares to the side that look like a health bar, I believe those are your lives actually. So if you lose a fight, it's not over. If you lose multiple times, um, then it is. If I remember correct, like I said, it's been a while. Uh, so I actually could have afforded to lose there. I just would have had less lives to deal with the matches later. Uh, do we want to go ahead and fight Raditz right away? I can't remember if there's any extra benefits to fighting like uh, the unnecessary enemies because like there's definitely stages where like there's other other characters you don't have to fight, but you can. You get some extra dialogue and stuff sometimes for sure. Also, I remember you can get like extra movement too. See how there's a one by Goku's head? I can actually get it up. I forget how, like I think certain like items give you more movement. Certain characters who are stronger have more movement, but sometimes you can move more than just one space. Let's just go ahead and fight Raditz off right. Let's just get it popping. That boy forehead shiny. Lend us a hand, would you, Kakarot? I don't really feel like it. You know, when I think about it, though, I wonder what made them change so drastically uh, from Budokai 1 to Budokai 2, because the story mode is like, way, way different. Like, obviously, Budokai 1 had in-game cutscenes and a very different story mode compared to this one, where you just were going through, like, chapters that just progressed organically. Um, and then this is, like, so far removed. And obviously, they never went back to anything like this again. I, I really like the formula they had in Budokai 1. Other than the fact that, obviously, you had to go back and do the extra chapters. Like, they should have just all been in it, like, in the first place. Like, the first, but whatever. Maybe it was really expensive to, to, to create Budokai 1, though. And they just didn't want to do that all over again. But, I don't know. Okay, he sidestepped ground start. Wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. How come he got shortcuts already? Oh, we do get the shortcuts. It is in Budokai 2. Okay, hold on. Hey, I thought we didn't get this to Budokai 3. I'm like, wait a minute, he's not doing no combos. He's just letting he's just letting energy beams fly. I thought it wasn't until Budokai 3 you get the shortcuts. Wait, hold up, hold up, do it again. Oh, wait, 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 wait. One more time, one more time. Charge your key. Are y'all ready? Y'all ready for it? You ready for it? Now oh, back up, back up, back up, back up. Ah, you know what I'm trying to do. Y'all know what I'm trying to do. You know what I want. You know what I want. You know what I want. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh, now you were just spamming him a second ago. You were just spamming him a second ago. Whatever, you're lame. You suck. Next fight we gonna do, we gonna do it against Nappa. We gonna do it against, you, you know what I want. You know what I want. You know what I'm looking for. <laughs> Who gonna tell him? Yeah, he want the run back. He want the run back. Again, I forgot multiple lives, so. Oh, I ain't the one running. His battle power is rising so fast. Yeah, I'm like that. I'm like that. Ten toes down. Always been on that. <laughs> oh, so he's gonna throw me out of my armor move. That's cool. That's fine. That did no damage, by the way. Mink. Oh, he dodged it. Are you just gonna casually sidestep my comment how like that? That's how you feeling? Are you just gonna casually sidestep again? Oh! This is so sick. They had stage transitions like this in Budokai 1, but they made them a lot better in Budokai 2. Like, that was a little bit more hype, I ain't gonna lie. A little bit more hype, I ain't gonna lie. They're in Budokai 3 as well. Hey, 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 camera. I, 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 I can use the camera zooming out a little bit, though. One more for the road. Oh, man. Anyway, let's have Trunks fight Raditz, because why not? Because why not? Trunks is obviously my favorite character, and, I, and that extends even to Kid Trunks. So it's just kind of cool to be able to play him this early on. <laughs> Maybe for the rest of the playthrough, well, I'll, I'll let you guys, well, I guess I'll have to let Twitch chat decide, because I'm recording this live on a Twitch channel at twitch.tv slash Rosa Sakura. Thanks for in the description down below. Um, but yeah, these, these playthroughs are all happening live on Twitch, and then I chopped them up for YouTube for you guys. Uh, and I was gonna say I could let you guys in the comments decide whether or not I should stick to like characters who belong in the story at this point Or if I should just pick whoever I want, but I think I'm gonna leave it up to twitch chat because 
Well, they're here right now and you guys are not. <laughs> I guess one of the perks and benefits of being in this in the, in the Twitch stream. And big shout out to everybody who is pulling up, by the way. People are definitely popping out for these and I really appreciate your support. Hey, here we go. Light work, light work. Go ahead, let Trunks finish them off. Go ahead, let Trunks finish them off. Maybe I should have actually finished them off with Goku to get the actual final. Yeah, actually, now nah, I think about it. I should have finished them off with Goku so that you can get the, 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 the final dialogue between the two. I should have Trunks craft the Dragon Ball. That's what I should have been doing. Ooh, and actually, I remember when you go to these like little Dende uh, spots on the map, I believe you get an extra health bar. Uh, so you get an extra life for your character. So that's also really cool. Spin, Roshi, spin! Spin, Roshi, spin! Oh, look, let's let's go Kaioken for the one time. Kaioken for the one time? What? Kaioken! Lock that. I think we charge up the aura, start getting that. Yeah, you see, you see, you see, you see the aura starting to come around us. Okay, but let me go ahead and finish the fight before I lose. Let me go ahead and finish the fight before I, before I lose. There we go. Kaioken. <laughs> okay, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. We all good. That's all good in the hood. Uh, our goal right now is to try to get the Dragon Ball before Nappa. I think he's only one space away. Yeah. So he gets the Dragon Ball. I don't remember if we get to claim it for beating him. Oh, <laughs> and you're ugly. Oh, that's a game over. Bro, what? <laughs> what? Hey, yo. Hey, yo, a game over on the first board? I was I was going to get the Dragon Ball, but I thought that was like a side. You know what I'm saying? I didn't even realize. Word, word. Or, or I didn't even realize that was like a crucial objective of, of the map. Go ahead, run it with Gohan this time. Hey, uh, so y'all remember when uh when Kid Gohan got really upset and he had but Raditz and Raditz nearly died? Imagine adult Gohan <laughs> fighting Raditz. Gohan ain't got no business being in the Sand Saga right now, but here I will fully grown adult Gohan against Raditz. Mink, <laughs> key blast. Hold that. But anywho. Uh, let's go get that Dragon Ball. And just like that, the Dragon Ball is mine. Mwahaha. All right, cool. Now that we've got that, now we can go take out Nappa. All right, I got the Dragon Ball. Time to go looking for the next one. And Gohan got the Dragon Ball, but yes, we, we, we have the Dragon Ball, yes. Oh, wait, is that the, we don't have to fight Nappa now? Wait, 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 okay, this is, I, I, I'm, I'm misremembering some stuff. It looks like Nappa and Raditz have been done in. I guess it's up to us, the Ginyu Force. I, <laughs> bro, <laughs> bro, <laughs> um, that's a crazy jump we just made. Budokai 2 is a lot different than I recall. Budokai 2 is a lot different than I recall. Um, let's go ahead and bring in Goten, because why not? <laughs> since, since we all over the place anyway, what, what if we just have Goten fight the Ginyu Force? You know what I'm saying? Go, go get the Dragon Radar, where the Dragon Ball at. Oh, what's right over here? That's what I was saying earlier about the Dragon Radar. Sometimes they're underground and you have to dig in the place that you're at and you get the Dragon Ball. Pretty cool little feature. Hey, you. You must know about the Dragon Balls. Tell me about them. Who are you? Are you that boy, no, he ugly. That's for sure. You do well. <laughs> you do well. Oh. Spin, Roshi, spin. Oh, he's also at half health, so it's not the end of the world. Also, this is such a cool stage. Put this stage in DBFZ. Put this stage in DBFZ. What are we doing, bro? Ow, that hurt it. Oh, so you just gonna sidestep. You just gonna sidestep my moves that you can sidestep? That's kind of kind of racist, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, there's a chance I actually die here, unless. No, 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 yeah. don't hold that. Ha, <laughs> you thought, you thought, you thought, you were this close, but you gotta be quicker than that. You almost had it, but you ain't quick enough. I'm back that ass up. Anyway, look at his eyes, or oh, that boy on, on that dope. You better understand. You cannot defeat me. He's right, you know. Um, you lucky I ain't break your spine. This is actually such a dope stage. It's so pretty. I really want a snow stage in DBFZ. I think we're not, I don't think we're ever actually gonna get more stages in DBFZ as much as it would be great. But here's, here's the thing, right? I like, I guess my, and honestly, I said this before and I started being, <laughs> got murked. I started being pessimistic again, but once rollback got announced for DBFZ, that should have opened the floodgate to my brain that literally anything is possible. Cause I didn't think we would ever get that. But even more so than that, I did not think we'd ever get an announcement for Tenkaichi 4. So if Tenkaichi 4 is real, literally anything, anything, anything is on the table. Like nothing is off limits anymore. So who knows? Maybe we will get more DLC for DBFZ. I don't think we will, but maybe we will. Dig, 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 dig. The Dragon Ball. Yeah, there it is. We got the Dragon Ball. Now we got two of them thang. Uh, we can go ahead and finish off Raccoon with Goten, because why not? Because <laughs> why not? I was going to say it'd be so sick if they did like a, a DLC music pack to put Budokai music in DBFZ. 
but they won't ever do that for legal reasons. Hey, homie did a crazy job plagiarizing though, because this music slaps, I'm not gonna lie. Can I go Super Saiyan by chance? Okay, no, I can't. Imagine I could go Super Saiyan right now. You do well. You do well. I wanted to hit him with the charge the back's kick, but he died too fast. Why you gotta be so weak, man? How you gonna be weak and ugly? Pick a struggle, bro. What are you talking about? I wouldn't really say turned. I was never. I was never really under him in the first place. I'll call you ugly as far as I care. All right, come on, Ginyu, go ahead, catch his hands. Hey. Also, I don't know about y'all, but I think Goku's gi looks a lot better when it's uh when the belt is hanging instead of like being a sash tied around his waist like that. You know what I'm saying? When the actual like tails of the of the of the belt hang loose, I think that looks a lot better. I mean, me. Ha! All right, beam clashes like the actual beam struggles aren't in this game. They don't come till Budokai three. No, I spent all that time against an app or no against Raditz earlier trying to pull that off. And I just to remember that it's not actually in this game. I need to learn something to do when they when they're on the ground like that other than just like key blasting. But if it works, it works. Mink. <laughs> Boy took a quick boot to the face. Also, the animations are like so much quicker and snappier. It feels like in this game than Budokai one. <laughs> Let's finish off Ginyu and then we'll head on over to I see. This guy is better than I thought. Yeah, you think? Sorry to ruin your grand entrance, but I'm gonna have to take you out again. Take yes, me I out to the ball game. game. Yeah. No one's ever spoken to me like that before. Except probably Frieza. Here, yeah, Frieza, 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 Frieza. Come here, boy. So you're Frieza, huh? You're a lot more puny than I thought. Puny is so crazy. I was gonna say you're a lot uglier than I thought. Also, he's already in Final Four. Maybe, but we don't know that yet. You got a lot of nerve. You got nerve. Word to Hannah Montana, my boy. All right, can't just get all the way to blue health in this game. Hey, yo, to, to him teleporting through me is insane. Not gonna lie. Block that. Oh, he thought you was behind me, didn't you? Yo, fight back. Fight back, Frieza. Fight back. Fight back, nigga. Hold this. I thought that was going to kill him. I'm not going to lie. Key blast. Watch yourself. I'm on your head top, boy. We ain't finished yet. If you don't bring your little globe trotting ass, boy. Got them crystal ball looking ass, boy. Oh, mirror, mirror on the wall. Who the ugliest of them all looking ass, boy. Face ass, boy. Spin, Roshi, spin. Hey, uh, he kind of doing a lot of damage. Oh, wait a minute. There we go. Ow. All right, bro. Let's stop blocking. Stand up. I said, stop blocking. Stand up. Stand up. I said, stop blocking. Now stand up. Eat this kind of a Stand up. What I tell you about blocking. I want to block. I'd be playing Tetris. Hold that. Goodbye now. This doesn't look very good. How you just go? How you just go? So, so, so. What I tell you about blocking. Stand up. Punch in the mouth. Eat one of these. I want to throw his ugly ass. The, the, the computer always texts the throw, man. I ain't even know you can tech throws in Budokai, if I'm honest. I found that out during Budokai 1 playthrough, that you can tech throws in this game. This is news to me. Oh, so you got an axe kick, too. Okay. All right, this is what we do. Okay, and as soon as I go for the kicks, as soon as I go for the kicks, to make those stop. All right. Cool, 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 cool. I said, stop blocking. You're still alive. Stand up. Goodbye. Oh, a clash? Say less. Say less. Wahoo, wahi, wahoo, 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 hey. It would have been so funny. It would have been so funny if he reverted back to base form after getting knocked out like that. <laughs> that would have been great. That would have been fantastic. And now we get Super Dragon Fist. Let's go. Uh, I can't believe I, Frieza, was attacked and hurt by those scum of the earth idiots. Members of the Ginyu Force, we're leaving here for now. You can't get away, Frieza. Unless you jump in your spaceship and fly away. You can, in fact, get away. And now we get the Snowy Mountain stage, which is a beautiful stage. <sighs> yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Coming to this right after fighting Raditz and Nappa broke my ankles. And now we're on Namek with Boo Saga Vegeta. <laughs> and now we're on Namek with Boo Saga Vegeta. <laughs> and Raccoon and Frieza and Ginyu. Tee hee. I was waiting. That boy said tee hee. Oh, you know what I'm saying? See, like in Budokai 1, we have fully animated cutscenes with voice acting. Now I gotta do the voice acting. I will kill you all, you scum of the earth. 
Seems like something happened back on the Earth. Frieza's looking only at Kakarot. <laughs> I was right to send only Nappa and Raditz there. I have a feeling that we'll succeed in taking advantage of the Earth, guys. Te Vegeta's not saying tee hee. That's just not, that's just not in his care. He would not, he would never. All right, bro. Stage three, defeat Frieza. However, however, you guys over on YouTube are gonna have to wait until the next part to catch this stage. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the Budokai 2 playthrough. We will in fact, like I said, be playing through Budokai 3 and so on and so forth. But if you guys wanna see me get that far, you're gonna have to support these videos as well. Make sure you drop in them likes and comments. Hit the video with like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already seen all this content when I'm bringing you. With all that being said, it's pretty much often. And remember, this is gonna happen to you swing the bat. Later.